हेलो स्टूडेंट्स आई एम राजीव सर आई विल बी टीचिंग यू मैथ्स इन स्टैंडर्ड एट ए स्टूडेंट्स नाउ आई एम गोइंग टू स्टार्ट चैप्टर टू एक्सपोनेंट्स एंड पावर इन द एक्सप्रेशन इफ यू राइट थ्री टू दावर फाइव सो हियर थ्री इज द बेस एंड फाइव इज द एक्सपोनेंट और पावर ऑफ थ्री और यू कैन से इंडेक्स so you can write 3 to the power 5 is in this form 3 into 3 into 3 into 3 into 3 this is the expanded form now exponent if a age any real numbers any real number and n is a natural number then a to the power n is n times where a is called the base a is called the base and n is called all exponent or index and a to the power n is the exponential form is the expo Nensial form. Now, next one is any non-zero number is raised to the power zero h. One. So therefore, if you can write a to the power zero, it becomes one. You can also write when two to the power zero is one. If x to the power zero is one. Now, laws of exponents. Number one. If a is any non zero number where m and n is are any two integers then a to the power m into a to the power n is equal to a to the power m plus n then base is same power will be added number 2 law number 2 if a is any non zero number and m and n are any integer and m is greater than n then a to the power m divided by a to the power n is equal to a to the power m minus n number 3 law third law number 3 if a h any non any non zero number and m and n are any two integers then a to the power m to the power whole n is equal to m to the power a to the power m multiplied by n uh, law number 4 if 
A and B are any two non-zero number and M is any integer then a to the power m into b to the power n then you can write a into b to the power whole m rule number law number 5 if a b are two non zero number and m is any integer then a divided by b to the power m is equal to a to the power m divided by b to the power m now i am solving some questions from given exercise let's practice 2.1 question number 1 express the following as negative exponent Question number A, 2 to the power 4. Question number B, 1 by 2 to the power 6. So you can write as negative exponent 2 to, the, 2 to the power 4 becomes 1 by 2 to the power minus 4. Because 2 to the power 4 divided by 1, so it when it is a in the form of negative exponents, you can write 1 by 2 to the power minus 4. Similarly, question number B. 1 by 2 to the power 6 is written as 1 by 2 to the power 6. And negative exponent, you can write 2 to the power minus 6. Answer. Now, I am solving question number 2. A. Question number 2. Evaluate. A question is 5 to the power minus 1 plus 5 to the power 0 plus 5 to the power 1. So you can write 5 to the power minus 1 is 1 by 5 to the power 1. The 1 is not written here. So 1 by 5 plus anything to the power 0 is 1. So 5 to the power 0 becomes 1 plus 5 to the power 1 is 5 is equal to 1 by 5 plus 5 1 6 you can write 6 divided by 1 take LCM 5 1 5 6 is 30 adding 31 31 by 5 answer now question number B 1 by 2 to the power minus 1 plus 1 by 3 to the power minus 1 so you can write 1 by 2 to the power minus 1 is 2 to the power 1 when it becomes in the form of numerator 1 by 2 to the power minus 1 it becomes 2 to the power plus 1 and 1 by 3 to the power minus 1 it becomes 3 to the power plus 1. So you can write 2 to the power 1 is 2, 3 to the power 1 is 3, add it 3 to 5. Answer. Now question number 3. Simplify. Question number A, A to the power minus 4, B to the power minus 7, C to the power minus 3, D to the power 3, <clears throat> divided by A to the power minus 7, B to the power minus 9, C to the power 3, and D to the power 
3. So, this is question you can convert a to the power minus 4 into b to the power minus 7 into c to, to the power minus 3 into t to the power 3 is already written here and it becomes when it comes up then it becomes a to the power minus 7 plus 7 b to the power minus 7 9 is b to the power plus 9 c to the power 3 is becomes c to the power minus 3 and d to the power 3 becomes d to the power minus 3 now adding the base is same so you can write a to the power minus 4 plus 7 into b to the power minus 7 into b to the power 9 into c to the power minus 3 into c to, to the power minus 3 into d to the power 3 and into d to the power 3 you can write a to the power 3 into b to the power adding because base is same so add the power minus 9 minus 7 plus 9 2 into base is same power will be added so minus 3 minus 3 c to the power minus 6 into d to the power 0 the student here is d to the power minus 3 so it becomes d to the power 3 plus minus minus 3 so d to the power 0 now so answer is a to the power 3 b to the power 2 and c to the power minus 6 and d to the power 0 is 1 so it is not written here so this is the final answer of the question now next question is question number 6 find x such that question number a 2 to divided by 9 to the power 3 into 2 divided by 9 to the power minus 6 is equal to 2 by 9 to the power 2x minus 1. So here is in this question base is same therefore power will be added therefore you can write only one base 2 by 9 and power will add 3 plus minus 6 is equal to 2 over 9 to the power 2x minus 1 so it is 2 by 9 to the power 3 minus 3 is equal to 2 by 9 to the power 2x minus 1 now equating these two because both are same so only power is written here only write the powers that means minus 3 is equal to 2x minus 1 transferring minus 1 this side minus 3 plus 1 is equal to 2x minus 1 minus 3 plus 1 is it becomes minus 2 is equal to 2x therefore x is equal to minus 2 divided by 2 to, to cut is equal to minus 1 this is the answer another question of question number 6 question number d i am solving question number d question is 4 to the power x minus 2 minus 2 to the power x plus 1 is equal to 0 you can solve like this 4 to the power x minus 2 transferring this number on the other side so it becomes 0 plus 2 to the power x plus 1 is equal to 2 to the power x plus 1 now you can write 4 2 square x minus 2 is equal to 2 to the power x plus 1 or you can write 2 to the power 2x minus 2 to the 4 is equal to 2 to the power 
x plus 1. So here is when equating these two, the only power is written here. Therefore, 2x minus 4 is equal to x plus 1. Taking 2x minus 2x and x this side, 2x minus x and 4 other side, 1 plus 4, 2x minus x is equal to x and 1 plus 4 is 5. This is the answer of this question. Now, I refer to the question which is given on the Tenno app as a homework. Okay, thanks.